earth signs virgo taurus capricorn let's take a look at what are the messages for september for you guys All right we're going to take a look and see what it is that earth signs need to embrace or will be embraced in this month and what needs to be released all right, so let's take a look here and let's get started here. Um, let's put this in water sign. Earth sign. Some of you could be dealing with the water sign. Oh, yeah, temper your criticism this month, okay? Um, there's a need to, you know, maybe not speak about something, something that you may not need to give too much of your attention to. Don't be so critical about something. Even if you want to say something, this may be a time to not even speak. Temper your criticism. The number 33 could mean something to you earth signs okay but what i'm getting here also if someone could be very critical this month you're being told to, to just remain silent um and be careful about what you're allowing yourself to hear um as far as negativity and criticism someone could be very negative around you and it could affect you you know what i'm saying so like you be careful about being too critical or judgmental and about what negativity is you're allowing in your ear gate, your eye gate, and, you know, for you to speak, all right? You have breaking addiction as well for the earth sign. So you're breaking some type of addiction. This could be gossip. This could be how much you are listening to, like, a lot of negative things or things that don't feed your soul, this month, um, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Yeah, the bottom of the deck is experience rebirth. So I feel like some of you stop breaking agreements. Yeah, you could be um, focusing more on your physical health, mental, spiritual, emotional health. Health, I said help. So some of you could be getting help for an addiction or someone around you. Okay, so someone, um, earth sign around you, there's it again, experience rebirth. Okay, did someone just give birth? Because I see like two babies here. It could be twins. Or someone could be pregnant. Mm. So also what I'm saying, somebody around you could be breaking an addiction and you're being told to temper the criticism. Maybe you may feel find yourself coming off a little harsh with someone this month. You're being told to kind of, I guess, pull back. Maybe someone's struggling with something this month and they feel like you're being very critical to them something like that all right let's see what is it that virgo taurus capricorn needs to surrender for september you could be struggling with something as well earth signs and someone could be this way towards you surrender to the beauty of the natural world Take a relaxing break and spend time in nature. Re replenish yourself by feeling the beauty and the ecstasies. It's time to spend some time alone. Get grounded. Um, for some of you who are overcoming some type of addiction or habit or something, and time alone will help you. And maybe you have someone around you that kind of gets under your skin. You may need to spend a little time alone to avoid really lashing out at somebody this month surrender to your full power your life is calling for you to step into your full power rather than playing it small so earth signs you may have been playing it small maybe because people have been you know so critical of you or you know maybe you heard some things about yourself that you don't like so you've been kind of dumbing down when you really need to be standing in your full power at this time. Don't worry about the negativity that others may, you know, try to project onto you. But Earth signs, it's time for you to step up, honey, and be who you're supposed to be. So after you come from taking this beautiful, relax, relaxing, maybe some of you are going on vacation or something that helps to rejuvenate you. When you come back, you're going to be stronger than ever, okay? So what else flipped over in here? Surrender to spirit. Once you've done everything you can to achieve a goal, turn the situation over to the divine. Let spirit work its magic for you. So you're surrendering something in September. And I feel like this is what it is. You're being told not to even have anything to say about the negativity because it looks like you're moving forward into something else or you're, 
you're kind of rising above a negative situation or a negative person because you're going through a rebirth and you're learning how to deal with situations better. Hmm. Yeah, some of you are on your soul's path. What else is going on for Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn for the month of September, my Earth sign? You may feel like you don't have enough time to do everything that you need to do. Okay, so focus on your time management this month. Um, Earth signs, time spent worrying is time spent. So don't worry about so much about something. Do what you can in the time that you're allotted, but don't spend so much time worrying, okay, about, um, I feel like, I feel like something's been on your mind. You're being told to release it, Capricorn. Don't spend some, I'm going to say Capricorn, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. All right, focus on that time management. What else? Also, Someone could feel like they're running out of time. Kindness. What if being kind to yourself really could change everything? Yeah, I feel like you giving yourself the self-love, giving yourself love in September is going to help you to deal with other situations better. Maybe, Earth signs, you are extremely busy and you're not putting enough time to yourself and maybe you're getting stressed out. Maybe you're overly critical about certain situations because you, you're tired. Maybe you need a little more rest or something. You get one more here. These two fell out. These two fell right out. Decision and needs. Yeah, look at these balancing scales here. Could be dealing with the Libra, but... Sometimes the best decision is no decision at all. Once again, you're being told to not take some type of action towards some negativity. So if you making a decision to go with your higher self, needs, do you need more time to yourself? <laughs> a break from thinking too much, a kind encounter with a friend, your needs matter, it's time to honor them. So for September, it's time for you to honor your, your own needs, okay, and Bring that balance into your life so that you can be in your full power. Maybe, um, earth signs, you haven't felt yourself because you could be depleted with things around you that are causing um, you to be kind of exhausted here. Hmm. Let's take a look at, at love here for, um, let me make sure. Take a look and see what's going on with love for earth signs healing family issues got the same thing for water signs your love life benefits as you forgive your parents so maybe what's going on um, earth signs is that you're trying to heal some issues around you okay with your family some of you could be new parents with these two babies right here um and you're not you don't have the time to yourself like you want to because maybe you have a full house maybe you have so much obligations and on top of that you're trying to heal something you got release your ex and heart to heart conversation so some of you need to go ahead and release something from the past it's time the time has come to clear your energy and heart to heart conversation honestly discuss your feelings with each other this you know when i did the water signs it was very similar energy it's almost um, it's giving me that where there's a decision to kind of move forward from a situation, maybe releasing someone who you have a long history with here, having a conversation and being honest and not being negative, not being critical of each other, but being open and honest. So there's decisions that need to be made um, in September, um, Earth signs, okay? Honestly discussing your feelings with each other so that you can heal a situation, whether you heal it together or you heal it apart. Yeah, because something could be deceptive around you. There could be some differences in the way you and someone think morally. You could be married to someone or someone could be married. But someone needs to let go of control issues and really be honest with, with yourself about what it is that you want. Maybe you're dealing with something here where, you know, you could be putting in so much of the effort, the work here, and you're not 
you're you're not getting you know the fair share maybe someone needs to pull their weight a little bit more what's the message of love here for earth sign friendship this friendship is leading to more so you could you could be in a connection with someone and it starts out as friends okay or this is past energy here you could what's the tell me more so it'll be different for everybody chemistry okay so for some of you you have chemistry for a friend or you may find out that a friend has a lot of you know is very attracted to you or you could be meeting someone new that starts out as friendship and it goes into um something more and you could be being told to release someone from your past okay you have spiritual lesson this person is in your life to teach you a spiritual lesson for some of you the lesson is that that you're better off as friends with someone you have better chemistry as friends versus trying to be in a relationship. So some of you could be releasing someone. Or someone could be releasing you. Let me get one more here. Because something is a spiritual lesson. Unavailable. Yeah. This person is unavailable to give all you deserve. So you're you're finding out that something is not somebody's unavailable, possibly because it really should just be a friendship. Hmm. Hmm. So some of you could be taking a leap of faith that it's safe for you to make the move you're considering. Yeah. Yeah. Some of you going through this rebirth are realizing maybe someone has been codependent around you. They need your help. It's not more of a relationship. It needs to be a friendship. Hmm. All right. Let's see what's the T around Earth signs. What's the tea around the earth signs for September? Thief, robbed, lost, theft, physical, emotional. So you may feel in September that something was is an emotional loss or a physical loss or um, that someone may have stolen something. Now, I'm going to tell you what I'm seeing in my mind's eye, earth signs, is that you may feel... That someone robbed you of your time. You may have felt like you've neglected yourself for someone who robbed you, for someone who's unavailable. Family issues is coming out again. This could be a family member. You could be at odds with a family member. You may find out that someone was trying to steal from you, maybe steal money, steal your energy. Or you may have dodged a bullet. You may find out in September you dodging a bullet here. Blocking off this negativity again. Temper your criticism. You could be blocking off some negativity that someone's trying to send your way. You could feel that, that someone is a hater or just a bit off. <laughs> and maybe a family member or something. Um, mm. I feel like you dodge a bullet in September. Let me get some more here. What's the around earth signs romantic love affair coming out in reverse and love triangle upright wow whoa so some of you could be dodging a bullet because there's a third party situation here that someone could have said that they're not in but love triangle is upright it doesn't matter if this romantic love affair is in reverse sex fix secret lover and fuck buddy Okay, so someone could have an addiction or they just can't seem to break this habit of being in third-party situations here. With love triangle, multiple lovers and choices, I feel like some, some of you are dodging a huge bullet by getting out of a third-party situation, okay? Someone could be robbing you of your time, your energy, even your money here, okay? Someone could want you in a third-party situation because um, and you could be dodging that. Like, no, <laughs> you you may make a decision to be friends with someone and not be in this. If you're in a third party, you may make a decision that you don't want it anymore. And someone else still does. Yeah. You got nightmares, insomnia, paranoia, anxiety, unable to sleep. So somebody's experiencing nightmares or insomnia about something in September as well. Okay, so that's the T around earth signs um, for September. Let me get one more. 
Yeah, somebody's unable to sleep. I don't know what that's about. Dust it off. Mm. And cloud hungry. So, um, earth signs, I'm going to just say this as well. I'm getting that someone is, parano is facing paranoia and anxiety because they have some type of addiction. I'm just going to just put this up here. And you guys can figure that out, okay? Because someone could be on some type of powder, all right? And um, they they may not be able to sleep. This could be you or someone around you. So if it's not that, they could be, there's something that someone needs to let go of, okay? So that they can sleep, so that they can heal these family issues. Um, someone is cloud hungry, say anything, does anything, or make shit up. You got somebody here who's a liar and, and very dramatic about what's really going on. Okay, so someone here could be exaggerating a story, trying to make something look different from what it is, okay? All right, let's see. What's this thief situation about? What's this thief for earth sign? The devil. That's your energy, um, well, Capricorn energy. Could involve a Capricorn, but I also feel like this is someone who's dishonest. They could have a sexual addiction that they need to go ahead they need to um break they need to heal someone could be karmic as, as hell okay someone could surround themselves around a lot of karmic or negative people here yeah nine of cups someone overindulges in something in september i feel like um you may release someone because this situation gets way out of control someone is selfish and they could want you tied to them okay someone's dealing with a Oh, Lord. So you could feel like you're dodging a bullet by releasing someone because they are very toxic and selfish. You should be counting. You'll be counting your blessings. If you have already done this, release someone, you counting your blessings because you dodged a, a huge bullet. Someone is only satisfied with themselves and what they can get. Be careful about someone trying to steal from you, take your energy, your money or something. Tell me more here for Earth Signs. Yeah, nine of wands. You're guarding yourself against someone who is very selfish and toxic and codependent in September. What's this clout hungry? That just made me feel like somebody would say anything to get what they want. I was about to cuss. High priestess and ace of cups. Yeah, because you have a knowing that you need to protect yourself. You also know more than what this person is saying, okay? You, your intuition is telling you, is showing you that you can have better with this Ace of Cups. That you are on your way to a new love, a new beginning, or marriage. Or there's something here that's going to be um, very emotionally fulfilling for you. You got a temperance card out here. Something comes into balance for you. Someone needs to control their excessive behavior here. And I feel like that is, that's the thing I feel for Earth Signs. You're being told to temper your criticism because someone is struggling. And I really don't know if you're just going to make a decision to leave this behind or if you're just going to be a friend to this person. I feel like someone just needs a damn friend. What is, what is going to be the outcome here for the earth signs when it comes to this situation? Seven of Wands. Lots of fire out here. Sagittarius energy with the temperance card, but then you have Capricorn, Pisces, Cancer score Pisces. Yeah. Seven of Wands, you're setting boundaries with someone. Okay, so Earth signs, this month, you're setting boundaries with someone who has some type of addiction. They could be addicted to your energy as well, but I feel like someone is could be dealing with a substance or alcohol, okay? Um, I feel like you, you are... Um, getting the strength to really stand up against maybe this person or stand up against this addiction because it could be you um earth sign you could be struggling here and realizing that you need to temper yourself you need to calm down take <laughs> you may be you know realizing that you need to cut back yourself but for many of you i feel like you could be releasing someone who can't seem to get it right. Maybe they're taking and stealing from you or something here. Woo, child. Let's get the messages of, it, of encouragement and wisdom here. 
in the end you tried and you cared and sometimes that's enough yeah earth signs you could be releasing someone who just will not get better you could have children with this possibly two children with this person in the end you tried and you cared and sometimes that's that's not that's enough i feel like you are realizing that you got to set boundaries with this person yeah mm, mm -mm. Let me pull some more. Those cards just fell out, but I was, I'm ready. Let's, what else for Earth sign? Adventure awaits. Go find it. So, yeah, it's like you are going through this rebirth or someone's going through this rebirth. It's going to send, send you in a different direction where... Your life can become will become so much more interesting. I feel like some of you have been focused on helping someone else so much that you haven't lived your life, okay? Yeah, life is an art. Paint your dreams, sing your songs, enjoy the dance. And when you meet your soulmate, you'll feel calm, no anxiety, no agitation. Same card I got for water signs. You are releasing an ex and you're going to meet someone who gives you that calmness, that peace. I feel like a lot of you are dealing with the anxiety and, and things because someone around you is in a very devilish energy and it's affecting you or you're doing this to somebody else. Okay, so let's take a look and let's, oh, we already did all of that. I think we're done. Let's go to the moonology. This. I want to, I'm trying to make sure that I use the exact same cards for all decks. So I did use a trigger warning. For the others, so let's go here. What's the trigger warning message from this ex or this person that you will be releasing? What's the trigger warning message? I know you want the truth, I just can't tell you. So, if somebody can't tell you the truth about. Their situation. I feel like your intuition is already telling you that someone is struggling or that there's something that someone is doing. And when you release this person, you dodge a huge bullet. You would lose it if you knew who it was. You're a beautiful person inside and out. So this person finds you very beautiful, but they can't tell you the truth. And you would lose it. And I'm going to say, if it's not a who, it's what. This could be a third party that's not even a third party. It could be an addiction. Which could be why love triangle was upright and then secret love affair or whatever came in reverse. Somebody could be having a third party, but it could be with an addiction or they're struggling with something. That you may not really know how serious it is, okay? Earth signs. So now we can go to the moonology and go ahead and close it out. What's the final messages for the earth sign? A win-win outcome is forecast. Full moon in Libra. I said that earlier. If some of you could be dealing with a Libra. What else here? What else here? Yep. Your commitment is being tested. First quarter moon. Yep. Your commitment is being tested, but I feel like it's your commitment to yourself. Do you love yourself enough? Some of you could decide to work it out, you know, and stick it out. But like I said, you may this person may need a friend or you just might need to have a friend right now while you work through some issues. Conclusions are within reach and confidence is your key to success. So these are the messages that I have for the earth signs, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Um, I really hope this message brings encouragement to you guys through the, for the month of September. If you are struggling with an addiction, please reach out for help. If someone around you is, is struggling with an addiction, hopefully you'll be able to talk this person into getting some help and you could be that support system that they need. But someone is not going to change until you release them. And that's for some of you, okay? All right, guys. So I'll see you on the next video. Have a great September.